Truth is, there's no real right answer. There's just what you experience. Feels like I'm holding on forever. Nothing's wrong. I should be feeling so much better. I'm going on a photo shoot. I'm gonna do like a cyberpunky type of thing. You can come with me if you want. <laughs> Let's go. In today's video, I'm going to show you what I've been doing the last week or so in Montreal. Okay, so I'm doing the photo shoot right now. It's fucking cold. So I looked up the cheapest countries to fly from Montreal, and London was one of the cheapest ones. So I booked a flight to London. Before going to London, I got in some photo shoots. And if you want to see the pictures from these shoots, you can go on my Instagram at Tori Robot. Hey, it's not so bad. Not that bad. It'll be positive. It was so cold, like freezing cold. But you gotta do what you gotta do for the good pics. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, this is torture. <laughs> I haven't really officially announced it, but I got my personal training certificate, so I'm a certified personal trainer, and I've been training people here and there to help with um, saving up some money. Another kind of hit thing. Okay. So it's been kind of okay. Burn you out again? Oh shit. So Is it push-ups? No. Do you want to do push-ups? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna do uh, 30 seconds of mountain climbers, and we're just gonna be like this. Okay. And it's just gonna be like this. Oh yes. Yeah. Okay. So uh, yeah. I'll tell you when to start. Yeah. Okay. Ready? Give it your all and just run as much as you can. Do 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. 10 more seconds, keep going. Cut it out, cut it out. <laughs> Got this, almost there, you're so close. And stop. Now we rest for 30 seconds. We're we'll down three times. 10 more seconds to rest. I feel bad because I know I'm torturing you, but you'll you'll be better just together. Yes. I'm here with you. We have to run away. Okay, we have to run, go. <laughs> God, just keep going. Run with me. Going back to my ex. No, no, no. Don't, don't get left behind. There's monsters. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. We only have ten seconds. Ten seconds. Ten seconds. We're so close. We're so close. Two, two more. Two more seconds. Two more. Perfect. Okay. Just like some downward dog and some deep, some my child pose. I always hated March. I used to be so obsessed with the weather. And then we're gonna go to a cat cafe here. I don't wanna look at the cats. I don't wanna look at the cats, I don't really care. I have experience with cat cafes already. Montreal, Canada was a really nice place to stay. It was chill and it wasn't too stressful of a city. Minecraft. Is this, this is goosebumps in French. Is this how you say goosebumps? Welcome to summertime in Canada. <laughs> like, look, it's good weather, guys. Let's go into the park. Everyone's excited because it's super warm, which is like 41 degrees Fahrenheit. <laughs> Here. The day before I left, I spent some time with my sister. She's been so helpful to me during all this time, and she's the reason that I came to Canada in the first place. It's very important to have support of people who love you. My life has been fucking messy and she doesn't judge me for it, so I'm very grateful. <laughs> no, I guess. <laughs> you're like, you're like cutting, cutting change, cutting quarters. <laughs> Taking B-roll. Just stuff I used to eat when I was a kid or something. That's what I've been reverting to lately. Yeah, I know. But if it's, it's comfort food, you know? Yeah. That's okay. I'm not judging you for it. I well, it's all I've been able to down lately. But hopefully, like when I get healthier, I'll be able to like start eating healthier. It's been filming me. It's filming our goodbye. Oh, just don't pay mind to it. I was on some mom. What would you do? I will Tori. I'm like, mom, stop. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you a tansy hug. Yeah, I was just like, oh, I'm just like. Well, I feel like I'm gonna break. 
Alright, any last words? Bye. That's it. Mm. Thanks for everything. You don't have to thank me, it's fine. You're gonna cry after I'm gone. Yes. <laughs> good, good it out. I need to cry. Oh, it'll help, probably. Yeah. With the, all the anxiety in our head. Thanks for sharing all your feelings with me and stuff. Thanks for listening to Mom's feelings and stuff. Feels like I'm holding on forever Nothing's wrong I think I always get like traveling anxiety before I go traveling again Everything's hitting me at once because this is kind of like a new start to a new life Because I've had to abandon a lot of things uh, Lately and it's all hitting me and It's kind of like you know the first day of school again or just this feeling of loss but also this feeling of something new so it's really hard to process and realize what i've lost what i might may gain and kind of accept the unknown now and be strong go out again and just accept whatever's going to happen tomorrow i have to suck it all up and Get everything done and go <laughs> so i can be emotional tonight but tomorrow i have to just i have to do and it's, this is a good thing i don't want you guys to think it's a bad thing i need this i need to start my life again sometimes you're not ready sometimes you don't feel ready or maybe you'll never feel ready sometimes you're very unprepared like physically mentally financially logically <laughs> everything sometimes you just have to do it anyways because you know our lives are really short so you don't need to be lonely alone. This is the day where it's time to move on. I was thinking a lot last night, and now we go. Because I've always wanted to go to London forever. Like it's the first place I wanted to go. But instead I kind of hopped around to different, to different places that wasn't London. I'm hoping with this trip it will give me more clarity. <clears throat> I'm a type of person, I don't know if it's because I'm autistic or what, but I can't envision things unless I actually experience them. I can't understand concepts unless I actually experience or see them. So the reason I travel around so much is because I'm trying to find somewhere that really resonates with me and that I want to put a base at because it's gonna take a lot of work to get citizenship wherever unless I live in America, which I don't really want to. Yeah, I just wanna see what is, all is out there. I found some oatmeal on this Airbnb. I don't have any food. My sister gave me that potato. It's starting to sprout though with the heart. Oh. Oh. I'm calling out for hope because now I go back on the road. I'm alone again and I know I've been told you play. Okay, so I just arrived. I arrived in London, it grilled me hardcore at the gate because um, I don't know why. Really, this is the, that's the first time that I've been questioned so hardcore. And they're like, do you have a returning thingy? And I'm like, no. And they're like, just question me like, well, how, how can you prove that you're not going to overstay here? And I'm like, can you offer some? <laughs> like, I don't know. I had to show them my bank account. They're like, you know, uh, they saw that guy, they're like, you know, what is an expensive place like? He's like, you know what, you need to plan better next time. And I'm like, yes, yes, I'm sorry, Anna. Usually I plan things really well. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, next time. I didn't have a good welcome here. So I'm just like, mm. And then like, I didn't sleep at all. And people are watching me vlog, but I, at this point I don't care. I need to find the train and I need to go with my friend. And he's also like, you meet up with a friend. How, who's this friend? I'm like, a friend? I don't know how to explain a friend. And he's like, how do you know her? And I'm like, oh. I'm like, I don't know. Social media? He's like, how long? And I'm like, oh, like months. He's like, how many months? I'm like, three. <laughs> and uh, yeah, was, was, he's like, so you've never met her in person? I'm like, story of my life. <laughs> <laughs> it's really hard to explain, you know, my life to people. It's always it's always such a struggle getting to and from airports. My body is always so confused whenever I hop around countries. One day I'm in one country, the next I'm in a different one with different time changes and weather. My initial thoughts on London is that it's a lot louder than Montreal. Like Victoria, Victoria again. Waiting in front of the bird ping for my friend that I've never met before. Now 
getting coffee because I have not slept. Um, I booked a train after, in case you want to know how to get from the London airport, Gatwick, to London, Victoria, you take a train. So I booked this train and now we're gonna get coffee and then we're gonna take the metro. I'm so out of sorts, like what am I doing? Disoriented. I really gotta make a lot of videos. It's like, no. We're topping up the uh, metro card another little expense to get a pay um, and there's different zones here in the UK I mean in London sorry there's zone one two three and four and is that all just four it's and five one, I guess yeah, six seven oh eight. and eight <laughs> okay we're finally on to the new adventure and even though I'm not 100% healed and good to go, it's still good to go because life is short and I hope you enjoy this adventure with me. The one thing that I have learned is that having good people around you is the most important thing in anything in life. shopping for the first time. This is the um, British the British Walmart. What's it called? Asda? Yes. We've got pulp. No pulp. We have a lot of orange juice here. Impressive. Isn't that good lighting? That is so fire. Some crashing from two different things of coffee. And I keep getting overwhelmed by um, people. <laughs> I'm like, for the past two months, I've literally been depressed in bed. Not really seeing a lot of people. And if I do, it's just like one person. Minimal contact. Yeah, and it's money. only like a couple hours. Yeah. So I'm like, so welcome to England. I hope you'll stay around and join me on my adventures here. I know this vlog wasn't like a ton of excitement because I just got here, but we did do some stuff and haven't slept for like 24 hours, so I'm really tired. And I'm gonna chill the rest of the day. Um, she's making some some veggie burgers. Look at what she made. Oh my god! I'm not You've kidding. outdone yourself. <laughs> this is my best work. <laughs> I don't know. Is it? Yeah. So good. That I'm also drinking this new vegan protein that I got. Yeah. She's gonna fatten me up. <laughs> I just, I appreciate you guys and thank you for not knowing what we're doing with me. <laughs> Alright, stay extraterrestrial. And I will see you in the next vlog. Okay, bye. <laughs>